My dear viewers, welcome to this Coffee Cup reading. This Coffee Cup reading is for all Virgos and it's for April 2023 for this year and I hope you all enjoy it. It's very deep. Your, your cup is incredible, very elaborate. I'm just, I was looking at it and it's just magnificent. Uh, it will take me a lifetime to finish it, <laughs> but I will give you the most important factors in this reading and I will try to make it as... Um, as short as possible so that it doesn't overwhelm you now my dear viewers again i would say i'd like to say thank you and thank you all for being here thank you for everything that you contribute towards the channel by watching and sharing your th thoughts with me all that makes a big difference for those of you who are new please don't forget to always subscribe to the channel and click on the bell so that it notifies you when i upload videos and for those of you who are new also be mindful that prior to drinking this coffee in the intention of all virgos i get connected and meditate prior to it um, with all your guiding angels to get you information that is important that they want to reach out to you and tell you and i write it down um, in point forms and deliver them to you right at the end of this reading so stay tuned for that now my glass is on and i will begin beautiful cup absolutely gorgeous so we'll start with the first thing that i see here very interesting it's all connected i see the beginning it looks like to me that the, it's time now it, it's reached to a level of time now where you need to really withdraw from where you're at and take a look take a, take stock of everything that's happening um you really need to go into deep contemplation and thinking and you need to build your strength from that because i feel like <clears throat> excuse me that there's been so much <coughs> excuse me my voice let me just drink some water i don't want to stop the video just for a second and <clears throat> yes i was just a bit dried up okay so what i was saying is that um oh yes a lot of distractions uh, could have been the cause of you not being able to sort of spend time thinking a lot of thought is needed now to really create some order in your life it's like i feel like there's there's chaos from there's been chaos everywhere and it's time now the universe is saying time for you to bring order into your life if you're feeling a bit confused and it looks like you are not seeing things clearly they're showing you the direction of seeing not seeing things clearly if you're feeling confused because of the chaotic lifestyle or the the things that are happening around you you need to really um, look at focusing your intentions on balance and balancing yourself as much as you can uh, that's the first advice and the second thing is um regaining your connection with the higher wisdom your higher self because that your intuition is the one that tells you everything and helps you move forward and especially in your daily life that that's that's so important for you to actually be able to do that now another important message here it seems to me they're saying be generous and be open um, to the generosity of others and have faith so not only be generous but be open to the generosity of others others that want to be generous with you let them there is someone however here there is someone that is sort of someone that's not quite emotional maybe by nature maybe there's someone that's sort of uh, how can I explain this person? It's very uh, bizarre. It's someone, you know, that dresses well. They're attractive, yes, but they may be deceitful. They are, it's someone that they're not as they appear. They don't show you the reality of who they are. You need to be careful and not to trust this person. Especially with your heart because they might break it so this person needs it's a warning sort of about this person this could be someone under i can't even mention the ages they could be in there below actually below 35 so they could be below 35 years old so you know who it is um they're cool very cool and they pretend that they are emotional but they're really not so this person is someone that um 
they're very much into the physical part of life, right? So, uh, but they are jaded, you know. They're very jaded. They're very, um, what's the word? Unappreciative. That's Maybe that's what it is I'm trying to say, yeah. I feel like uh, you will have a challenge with this person. And overall, there is uh, maybe this major challenge I'm seeing could be in connection to this person. I see a rat here. Uh, and a rat represents a new beginning. So there could be a new beginning that sort of releases you from this person. Um, and I see the, the cat here too. So the year of the cat, which is this year, the year of the rabbit. You know, you could be on the defensive side and trying to sort of prepare yourself for something. It's like deep inside of your heart, you know, you know something is not right. And you know you're surrounded with a situation where it may be just physical and nothing more. There's conflict, there's setbacks at this point in time, but I feel like one challenge and all this headache will be over. You need to see things more clearly. You need to be aware of what's happening. Your inner strength is overwhelming. There are no easy answers to this uh, situation. The only answer I see is that one major challenge uh, will open the doors and remove conflict and setbacks in your life. Your inner strength and perseverance is going to do the rest. It will see you through, but you need to keep going until um, you reach to an absolute ending of a matter or a situation. Then this is closing your heart off for a while. This could be someone that you might might be, um, you know, because I'm seeing emotional barriers after this. So it could be someone that you were involved in because I'm seeing um, that you are upset Although you were in denial, some of you were in denial because I see the glasses, but um, you need to accept the reality now, the reality of your problems and keep the situation uh, from, you know, going further. You don't want to keep slipping uh, into into delusion, let's say, into, you know, being in denial. You can't be, you can't afford to be in denial because your time and your energy is being wasted. You need to take action. You need to compromise and 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 find some sort of resolution. But, you know, even though I'm saying that, uh, as a psychologist, I would say that, <laughs> ex-psychologist, but what I'm saying, what I'm seeing here is that there is uh, no future in this situation. It is something that is coming to an absolute end. And your higher self is trying to tell you, your, your intuition is there bombarding you, letting you know, but maybe you are too much involved to see the truth. You need to trust yourself. You need to trust your, um, there's so much to, your higher self, your intuition has so much to offer. You need to go deep and, and trust yourself, you know. Uh, there is so much uh, divine in you, divine um, connection that you've got to, you've got to be prepared uh, for what's coming. And what's coming is spectacular. I'm seeing um, a new beginning that's going to bring you a lot of truth and you'll get to know why certain things happen and this year itself again it shows itself again another cat chinese year of the cat wow um it shows that there is uh chinese year of the rabbit sorry they call it the rabbit i call it the old way um, the cat but they cat rabbit same thing um success is coming your way and i feel like uh they are coming small small and then they're getting bigger 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 as they as we go along like the successes and there's a lot of healing with this beautiful cobra here chinese ear of the snake it could be or could be um just the fact that it's a snake and it's a cobra um, a snake is about healing healing from love healing because of love but there's finances also money is getting improved dramatically uh, there might be a small lump sum coming and then a bigger lump sum and bigger amounts of money are coming so um i feel like you are going to be doing exceptionally well and there is a lot of abundance decisions are going to be guided properly uh, decisions are going to be made honorably there's truth here truth is aligning everything for you this new beginning is going to be spectacular it's going to bring opportunity for change and there'll be no more problems it's like you're putting all the problems aside maybe it's because of this new beginning uh, that you are entering but again 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 i'm seeing unexpected money coming and making major changes in your life there's property here something about property buying property change of residence uh, this is affecting your judgment this money because you got to make you know rash decisions big money unexpected there is a contract there is um, a contract to be signed or agreed to 
you will reach to some sort of agreement and you are in position of authority after this so you are buying something big and major big time i also see right after this there is a beautiful proposal coming someone is proposing an idea or something it could be a love proposal it could be you really need to be very careful when you're speaking it's it's a very sensitive situation and um there could be a proposal to go somewhere, an invitation, or it could be a love situation where you really are going to be dealing with someone very considerate, very loving, very, very, very considerate. Someone, um, it could be uh, somebody of water energy. I'm not quite sure. Could it be water or is it earth? I'm seeing earth more than anything else. As I was saying, my dear Virgo, I'm seeing that this uh, proposal could be a, a romantic one, a sensitive one, someone sensitive. It could be earth energy, very strong here, earth, fire. I'm seeing earth or fire. Um, could be fire is Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, and earth is Virgo, like yourself, Taurus, Capricorn. So very strong proposal or very strong idea, or you could be going into business with someone. But the most important fact that I see a lot of good harvest here, happiness, celebration. There's a grand big fish here. And what's amazing about this fish, it's got the tail of the fish and the head of a spanner. So whatever it's coming, this uh, amazing harvest, this money or this... Um, something like a key to unlock something like a spanner to heal some a situation it's bringing understanding it's bringing happiness it's bringing success in a relationship it's energizing you it's it's about it's so important this time you're getting together and celebrating an invitation a social event um a resolution a resolution to something with a lot of luck the tail of the fish and the head of a spanner. <laughs> How amazing is that? But there's celebrations, there's getting together, there's rewards, there's finally fulfillment to the highest level, highest level of fulfillment, starting something fresh, um, victory, honor. There's honor, there's recognition, but there's more than anything else, there's triumph and success for you big time. Something you've done or something you're doing, you'll be bursting with pride that because it's going to be recognized. There is a beautiful love here. Do you see this love heart? Right in the light, something amazing, a new love, love life. Someone amazing, someone with great energy. Um, I feel like this is a new beginning. For, for some of you, it could be a, a new project, a new business. But for others, it could be... Because I've got also a new something here. The very prosperous new beginning. And then I've got a new love life. Um, something or someone mag magnetic. I feel like it is to do with the journey of the heart. I feel like you are moving into a level of happiness. A level of... It's like love is within you. And you're finally finding the person who will appreciate that and align with that and want exactly what you want. That kind of love. That's what I'm talking about. That kind of, it's like you're finally finding your other half. This is the only thing, this is the only time you're feeling secured. You're feeling strength and stability in a relationship. You're meeting someone that will help you understand how incredible you are and all the qualities that you have within you and how much love you've got within you. And that is going to be spectacular because this person, this person, you and this person are growing together big time. You're going to be so happy and lighthearted, a lot of joys, joy. You're finding out things. Things are coming to light. You're understanding why they did this and why did that happen a beautiful reindeer next to um, and you're adapting to the change accepting understanding what's going on uh, there was a situation that was just sensual maybe it was just sensual and nothing more uh, maybe this person wasn't honest so you know now you don't have to even question this person because this person wants everything that you want and they want to build with you i feel like you can trust this person and the situation is calling for you to trust this person. Trust is everywhere. There is a chain of event taking place. And it's in regard to um, love. It's amazing. It's all about love, my dear Virgo. It's about love, unconditional love. It's about oneness and passion and affection and attraction. And, you know, uniting together, working together. But there's also a chain of events. So there could be a family situation, children. Um, somebody that makes your heart flutter would really fulfill your heart. It's again to do with love. Someone wonderful, someone that will declare that they love you. There's declaration of love. There is an arrow of love and declaration. A powerful, very powerful words. You're going to hear those words. Um, you know, I love you. 
And this is going to be incredible. This is going to make you hover all over your cell phone, waiting, waiting when you'll see this person, the messages that are coming. You're falling in love deeper and deeper. You're choosing love over, over everything else. And I feel like you're transcending. Many of you are thinking of going somewhere on a holiday, a short trip, somewhere where there is, there, maybe there is a place where there's snow. Um, in the winter, it snows. Maybe I'm seeing like a snow ski. Some of you could be going on skiing or snow ski or a place that has snow. Some of you are going on invitation. Some of you are traveling with love and in regard to love. So there's that. And there is some of you that might be considering, uh, you know, doing your honeymoon in a, in a place where there's a lot of trees, but there's also a lot of uh, snow. It's amazing. Be authentic. Be real to who you are, your feelings. If you don't want to go there, do you know say what you want be uh, you know don't just agree for the sake of agreeing you can say no if you don't like something be yourself you'll be accepted by this person this is your soulmate like this is a person that really wants to do everything with you i see very 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 strong earth energy here big time earth 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 and in the midst of that earth my dear virgo this person has got virgo in them but taurus they have very strong Taurus in them. They have strong Taurus, but there's also Capricorn. So Earth energy also Capricorn. So Taurus, very strong. Capricorn, strong. And then there's fire. Fire energy. Mm, very interesting. Fire. Just look at the time. I'm doing well. Yes. Fire energy. Sagittarius. I've got two arches. There's Leo and there's Aries. Of course, fire energy is Leo and Aries, but Sagittarius has two of them. So Sagittarius is very strong in this person. I also feel that they are good communicators. So there's Gemini. And finally, Gemini, good communicators, witty, and there's Aquarius and air. So there's air energy in them, which makes them a very intriguing uh, energy. Why? Because fire and air both need earth and they are filled with earth. There's Taurus and there's Capricorn. So you will do well because you are earth energy and you will combine exceptionally well. You can build mountains together. The fire gives you the heat that you need. The air gives you the adventure, the romance, the um you know that that analytical kind of get together wants to know you wants to spend quality time with you fascinated by you and you love that you love all that uh there is also a situation with the chinese year of the pig here two pigs i'm seeing chinese year of the pig whether it's yourself or the person i'm seeing two horses chinese year of the horse also that means um success will be there also for many of you success is coming uh, those of you who are dealing with the chinese year of the pig or the Chinese year of the horse, success and freedom. Chinese year of the rooster here also. There's uh, uh, one, two, three roosters. Chinese year of the rooster, which means plenty is coming. You will feel that you have a lot, plenty, abundance. Um, there's two dogs here. Chinese year of the dogs. It's about pets, starting a family for some of you. But there is that connection to the dog, Chinese year of the dog. It could be yourself or the person. Uh, they are very loyal, this person you can trust. Uh, the dog is lo all about loyalty and friendship. I also see Chinese year of the rabbit, which is this year. This person could be born the Chinese year of the rabbit or Chinese year of the dragon because they're one that you could be leaving a relationship that was with the Chinese year of the rabbit or Chinese year of the dragon. So there could be part of this person or leaving because I'm seeing a mask here. So I'm thinking possibly, maybe um, that could have been uh, the dragon and the rabbit are the ones that you're leaving behind and moving forward because don't forget this is the beginning and this is the ending and they are combined uh, leaving someone and 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 meeting the new so um my dear virgo there is so much incredible changes happening and now i will deliver to you everything that's been said transactions so many of you are in the midst of transactions um do the math they said calculate everything, analyze everything. And it says something about October. Somebody born in October could be a Libra or a Scorpio. And you're questioning things. Why? Why? Maybe you're saying, why is this person like this? Or why should I do this? Or why? So it says do the math in regard to that too. Transactions and somebody born in October. Calculate everything. Look at everything. Someone isn't quite truthful. Oh, wow. There it is. There it is. Someone isn't quite truthful someone is not being honest with you that's where the mask is all about that's what i was trying to work out the mask and in the midst of the mask we've got the cat and the rabbit and then there's a dragon so think well about what's happening here someone isn't quite truthful and it says no the answer is no um i just have to stop the time uh no and then there's chinese year of the ox buffalo 
maybe the new person is coming could be born the Chinese zero the ox buffalo. But no, we know we do know, um, yeah, what they were. I just yeah looked at that the horses the pigs. Okay, Scorpio is mentioned here. Scorpio is another person like it could be the same person born in October because Scorpios are born in October. In every way. The truth is necessary. The truth, the truth. Uh, they've said that very strong. If you're confused, the truth will let you release you. So much disappointment. The truth will bring you so much disappointment. But it's so important that you do know the truth. Um, something about chicken. It could be the Chinese year of the rooster. The chicken represents the rooster. They call it the chicken or the rooster. And there was two of them there. So um, chicken could be also something that you're doing, dealing with a business or working with chicken or a job with chicken. Signs are going to be everywhere. Something about gym, gymnasium, perhaps taking care of your health is going to be a must or going to gym together with someone or meeting someone at the gym. That could be an, another possibility. Pain. If you're doing excessive gym, um, excessive workout, there could be pain. You've got to be very careful careful and when there is pain they're saying here the signs there's signs of the pain that you have to pay attention to it the signs are there to show you uh, then i was given herbs and natural remedies look into herbs and natural remedies for your pain because apparently your guardian angels it wasn't here it's amazing they're showing that there is pain and there's uh, herbs and natural remedies that to help you with the pain but pay attention to the signs of the symptoms and and Try to work it out, what, what's happening. Um, something about bangles, which is all about celebrations and parties and getting together. Bangles are also um, uh, to do with uh, color and happiness coming in your life and, and celebration. Uh, someone nonconformist, uh, like maybe it's yourself or someone that's not conforming to what they're supposed to be doing, not following uh, the mainstream and, and, you know, sticking to what they believe. Uh, then I've got number and uh, letters here, uh, initials of people that uh, will impact your life in April. We've got O, I'll put them up here so you can see them. We've got O for Olympics, K for Kiwi, L for London. Twice I was given Y for yellow and then the R for Rome. So Y, yellow, love, L. K, kiwi or kiwi fruit or kilo and O, Olympics or olive. Uh, these are shout outs to people with these names or these, this could be the initials of someone uh, that's going to be very special to you perhaps. Or maybe you need to do the math in regard to the situation or someone that's not being truthful with you. It could be that either, but th these are important initials for you. And then finally, I've got number three. Those of you born in the Chinese year of the tiger, pay attention big time uh, to this. Those of you who are born and dealing with people born in March. Uh, March people are Pisces and Aries. Also three is to do with transcending where you are, learning the truth, moving forward, becoming more wise. And it's about families. And it's all happening within three. From the time you see this up to three months, a lot of changes happening in families a lot of situations better situations happening in families union starting a business together considering uniting with family to buy a business together perhaps an investment or even uh, perhaps um, putting a, you know working collaborating with people also and doing quite well with the three so um, that is the end of your reading i do hope you enjoyed it my dear virgo i wish you abundance abundance of love and light do give me a thumbs up if it resonates with you and subscribe to the channel and click on the bell for uh you know for different videos that i do so you can always be notified and don't forget to share your thoughts with me i wish you abundance of joy happiness and a lot of blessings namaste